Hello everybody, my name is Richie Garcia and I'm the owner of the Rockford Bungalow. The Rockford Bungalow is actually my home, which I purchased in 2007, and I've had probably about 40 to 50 guests over that time frame. I've had nuclear engineers, I've had uh, law interns, medical students, traveling nurses, occupational and physical therapists. I've had a lot of people actually stay with me and I've been very, very happy with uh, sharing my home. Now, I'm actually in Mexico. I'm taking care of my mom. She's 92 years old. My dad passed away several years ago. And so I'm offering my home now on, a, on an exclusive basis. So if you're a traveling nurse or a contractor and you want your own space, my home might be a very good solution for you. Uh, there's four main hospitals in Rockford. The first is a Swedish American Hospital, which is also the Heart Hospital. It's a pretty good sized campus. And that's one, one mile from my house, door to door. Then there's two Mercy Health Hospitals. There's the Rockton campus, which is about four and a half miles away. And there's a Riverside campus, which is about 20 minutes away. Then about 10 to 12 minutes away is OSF, uh, St. Anthony's Hospital. Just down the street is Van Mater Rehabilitation Facility. Uh, that's a, a compass facility. And that's about, uh, about six, seven minutes away. It's only a couple miles away from my home. Freeport Hospital is a little bit further. I have had a couple of uh, traveling nurses that have stayed with me over the past few years there. And uh, that's about 35 minutes away, okay? The nuclear plant, Exelon Nuclear Plant, is about 40 minutes away. And uh, we have UTC, which is um, Collins Aerospace. That's uh, the main campus. It's about 10 minutes away. Um, other facilities that you might be interested in, Woodward uh, in McChesney Park. Uh, that's probably about 20 minutes away also. My home is, uh, is a good solution if you're looking for, you know, short-term accommodations. Uh, while I'm away, nobody else will be there. So if you want to rent it and just be by yourself, that is a definite option. If you want to rent one of the smaller rooms, that is an option also, but you might also have to share the home with somebody that rents the second room, okay? I primarily rent two rooms or half the house, okay? Those are the two options. All utilities are included. It's fully furnished. Uh, like I said, it's close to every all the hospitals and a lot of manufacturing companies. It's about uh, 10 minutes from downtown and uh, easy to Chicago. I mean, you can get to Chicago in about an hour and a half, okay? St pretty straight shot. Um, I'm a U.S. Army veteran. Since COVID started, I've been the sole care provider for my mom in Mexico, which means I travel back and forth. I'm on a very limited income. So the rent that I draw from my two homes, I do actually have two homes, uh, is, my, is my sole income, folks. So even if you're not going to rent for me and you hear this video or you see this video, share it because there might be somebody else that that might be looking for housing in the Rockford area, and it'd be a great help, okay? It'd be a great service to me and my mom. Um, I try to offer the best service possible. I'll, I'll tell you right now, it's not a five-star hotel, my home, but it's a warm, cozy home, and I have good neighbors. That's the really good thing about my neighborhood is I have really good neighbors. A lot of them are veterans. I have, I have about five nurses, a teacher, a police officer, and a couple of manufacturing people um, in my neighborhood. And we all know each other and we all pretty much take care of each other. Uh, one of my neighbors manages my home while I'm away. So you'll get the key from them. And then another my, one of my neighbors is my housekeeper too. So I can pretty much manage everything from Mexico. But I'll tell you what, it's, uh, it's a little bit challenging. And, and if you're a traveling nurse or a traveling contractor, you know about challenging. You know what it is to try to find a, a home or a facility to stay at, uh, affordable near your work and, and sometimes it's hard because there's a lot of people traveling or, or or some people won't rent on a short term they want a full year or six months please and and i do my best to work with you okay so if you're in a similar situation like me and you need to uh be with your family or a family member uh in rockford due to an urgency or an emergency and you need housing I might also be able to uh, provide that housing for you. That might, I may be a, a good solution for you also. So once again, you know, share my information. 
even if you might not be able to uh, rent or it's not the right solution for you, but you know that somebody else could benefit from this. So I'm talking to you recruiters, recruiters and, uh, and other people in my network. Help me out. I greatly appreciate it. And you know what? My mom would appreciate it too because the longer that I can stay with her, the better care I can give her. And she deserves that for being 92 years old. And, um, and I'd, be, I'd be grateful. I'd be very grateful and very thankful for folks sharing my information. Remember, the Rockford Bungalow in Rockford, Illinois. Website, rentmyroom.com. Rentmyroom.com. Thanks a lot, folks. Safe travels.